Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. Before we move on to any further details, I would really love to thank you all for your enormous love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed yet, I mean what are you waiting for guys, hit that subscribe button now. Also please don't forget to press the bell icon. According to a source, Meghan Markle, Prince Harry, and their children Archie and Lilibet expressed their love and prayers to King Charles on his 74th birthday in a private message. A knowledgeable source has disclosed that although Lilibet and Archie's parents were unable to publicly wish Charles a happy birthday, they did so privately on behalf of the Sussex family. Following the passing of Britain's Queen Elizabeth II, Archie Mountbatten Windsor, the son of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, officially became a prince, according to media sources on Friday, more than a year after his mother's contentious assertion that he was refused the title due to his race. After the passing of her grandfather Charles, the Prince of Wales, and his ascension to the throne, his younger sister Lilibet Lily Mountbatten Windsor also gained the title of princess, according to the Guardian newspaper. Archie and Lilbet, the kids of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, may have video called King Charles, Charles' mother, Queen Elizabeth II, who ruled the country for 70 years and passed away in September at the age of 96, hasn't been around for his first birthday. Charles observed his first Remembrance Day without the late Queen over the weekend. He was joined by his wife, Queen Consort Camilla, as the nation remembered the Commonwealth's dead warriors. Prince William, Middleton, Prince Edward, Sophie, and Princess Anne also made appearances at ceremonies honoring the fallen soldiers, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, who live in California with their two children, Archie, three, and Lilibet, one, were noticeably absent. Since the Sussexes' resignation from their royal duties in 2020, there has been escalating friction between the Duke and Duchess of Sussex and Charles. And even though Markle made an effort to reconcile fences by asking for a private session with the king, it doesn't appear that any peace offerings were given. It is important to note that Lilibet, the daughter of Harry and Meghan, celebrated her first birthday on June 4, 2022, and that King Charles, his wife Camilla, and other senior royals also tweeted birthday messages to her. Despite reports that they spoke to the monarch in private, Prince Harry and Meghan elected not to post a public statement on their Archwell website, which was last updated on Sunday. So what do you think about this news, guys? Write down in the comments what you think and let me know. Until then, guess we'll just have to wait and see if things turns out to be something after all. Also, if you never want to miss any of my sizzling royal updates like this, subscribe and press the bell icon. As simple as that. Thank you so much.